So. Hello. So. Hi. Uh, we just got done playing Last Jedi. I needed a minute to recover. <laughs> and now we're going to play The Rise of Skywalker. Go back, go back, go back, yeah. go back. Yeah? Look on the bright... Go back one more. Look on the bright side. We're 38% of the way through The Last Jedi. You'll only have to do 60% when we come back to it. You are giving me such a headache, Jacob. So, now we're playing The Rise of Skywalker. I actually kind of like The Rise of Skywalker, but only because I forgive uh, the sort of very odd creative decisions that yeah. needed to be made in order to fix everything The Last Jedi forgot yeah. to do and messed up. Before we start, can I say something about the diorama? Yeah? So, like, if you look at, like, every other uh, diorama in this display, it's, like, a scene from the movie that's, like, super iconic and memorable and cool. I think the only other one that could be, like, remotely considered weak is episode one, the negotiation scene. Ah, eh, you could probably could have done pod racing for that instead or something. But Rise of Skywalker, like, I know it was in the trailer. I didn't find this scene very interesting. Of like it's the a meme, Jacob. The it's the meme of Ray running away from the baby. <laughs> oh, I suppose that is true. Maybe they are because they do do a lot of meme bait in this game so far. Yeah. But it's just like I feel like you know the Emperor's throne on Exegol with the big like Lados contraption. Yeah. That feels more iconic for Rise of Skywalker for me than this. Yeah, or like the wreckage or, of the Death Star, or 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 the speeder scene with like the paint they launch off the back of the speeder. Yeah, um, like all of those are scenes that would work way better than this, at least in my opinion. Because like, like move away from it, move away from it. When it's not animated, it's just Ray in a desert. <laughs> True. <laughs> that's, actually, that's, actually, that's actually, actually, boring. actually, Jacob, Jacob, hang on, hang on. Oh. Oh, it leaves. It, it did still animate after I left huh. it. Huh. Weird. Okay. All right. Well, let's begin. Let's begin. So, I'm having a feeling this is going to be our longest recording session. Because it was, like, the longest movie. Because it was a long movie. A long movie. A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. Star Wars! Episode 9, The Rise of Skywalker. The dead speak! The galaxy has heard a mysterious broadcast, a threat of revenge in the sinister voice of the late Emperor Palpatine. General Leia Organa dispatches secret agents to gather intelligence, while Rey, the last hope of the Jedi, trains for battle against the diabolical First Order. Meanwhile, Supreme Leader Kylo Ren rages in search of the Phantom Emperor, determined to destroy any threat to his power. Somehow Palpatine returns. Somehow. No, I'm going to save that till we actually see him on screen. The joke doesn't work yet. We have to wait, okay? Okay. Okay? Okay. Okay? All right. All right, okay. Skipping the Mustafar scene. Right off the bat. The Sith Wayfinder. Yep. The dagger to find the Wayfinder to find the Exegol. At last, my boy. I Hand have fish? Every voice you have ever heard. is a pathway to many abilities some consider to be <gasps> natural. Darth Jar confirmed. Somehow, you Palpatine returned. Everything. A new empire. A new empire. Find the girl. 
and become what your grandfather Vader could not. Somehow even more rushed in the actual movie, but somehow works Palpatine better. returned. Yeah. Somehow Palpatine returned. Oh, it's the slug guy! I'm the spy! No, I'm Spartacus. <laughs> I'm the spy! <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. First level. Oh. Oh, did, did you drop in? Oh, yeah, you're yeah, in. I'm in. You're in. Okay, good. At least it's not like... Oh. Okay, maybe I should be dodging these attacks. Your mission is to kill people. Mine is to dot. Yeah? Mine is to About dodge. That. Canister! Did we get it? Yeah. I think you just have to destroy stuff in the vehicles. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying, Jacob. Jacob, I'm trying so hard. I don't believe you. Well, I don't believe you! Oh! I'm trying, Jacob. I'm trying so hard. Did we get... Yep, we got that one. Okay. No oh! Wait, was that a canister? Ooh. Yeah, it was, apparently. We have four out of five canisters. Oh, yeah. There you go. Did a thing. Oh, uh... Whoop. Whoop. This is nice. Now good. that I know what I'm doing, this is actually kind of nice. I was just thinking that. This is nice, right? It's a nice, nice, relaxing... Nice, relaxing chase to the death with everyone exploding. Yeah. Ah! Get us back to base. Oh. How thick do you think that ice wall is? Is it odd that this is a level? Is it normal that this is a level or odd that this I is a level? This is the first action scene in the movie. Oh yeah. Oh oh yeah, okay. But also it's like the it's like the one scene from Rise of Skywalker that if I was going to rewrite the film I would just flat out skip. <laughs> yeah. It's the one that like a lot of people forget, and in my opinion it is the one that I kind of forgot, you know? Yeah. It was a cool action scene, though. Um, Is the fifth canister going to be somewhere in here? Um... Ooh, that's a fun build. Ooh, I like it. I like it. Ah! <laughs> Jump scare! We got jump scared. Oh, one space slug to another. Ah, uh. one space slug to another. <laughs> the corpse is still in there, you oh, know. Oh, there's a rasta. <laughs> Be with me. Be with me. Now this was the scene Be where, like, when everybody said Ray was OP, this was the scene where it was like, okay, yeah, there is no way. That <laughs> she would be able to pull that off. <laughs> Floating that many objects that perfectly at the same time. Mm -mm. A skip and a jump. 
replay on that. Maybe this won't be as long as I was worried it was going to be. We got True Jedi. We some somehow, so True Jedi returned. Well, we got two of the challenges. Poetic flying. And we got four out of five mini kits. We were actually very near, close to beating wow. that level first try. Whoa. That's, That's wow. kind of cool. Finn, episode nine? I guess you have the Pro, gun, so, so you're kind of on mini kits. Booyo. Oh, was that episode nine? Millennium Falcon, episode mm -hmm. nine? All right. Swing from that area. I'll be a backpack by <laughs> Uh. It's like poetry. It rhymes. Yeah. Can I, I will jump across. I will say the the Rise of Skywalker does kind of feel like a film, like. They promised us a trilogy of films, and they needed to finish the story somehow. So, like... How, how do I get across? I don't think you do. I think you just chill. Okay. Keep going, Ray. I think it might be like the Dagobah level. You just chill. Well, actually, yeah, because he's supposed to be the finish segment. line for her to drop the tree on him. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Oh. So I'm just gonna watch. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna sit here and watch you. Okay. Uh, you want to talk about some commentary stuff? You want to have uh, some. Commentate have on some, things. Uh, yeah. Commentate during this gameplay commentary. Well, Would you like you to know, do that? Uh, that theoretically, I could do that, but I don't really feel the need to right now. Jacob. Yeah. If I'm doing all the work. Yeah. I think you owe the viewers. You doing all the commentary. Okay. Uh, so... Um... Uh... Uh, that, that, um... That new Ghostbusters film came out. Okay, don't talk I, about that. Um... Uh, Sock the Hedgehog 2 just came out. Okay, we can talk about that. Um, I haven't seen it. But it's got knuckles and tails in it, so that that's cool. Oh wow, amazing! Both of them. That's pretty neat. Um. Uh. So um. Sonic is a hedgehog, and he's blue, and uh, he runs really fast. Uh, but he's also got like a bit of an attitude, and he likes chili dogs. Who are you? It said Rose Tico. Oh, is that? Oh, I thought you died. Aw, oh, man. Oh, it's Rose Tico's identical twin sister, Rose Tico. She actually did have a sister who died in like the opening of the Last Jedi, and it was super dramatic and sad. And everyone forgot that character existed. Go, go. Actually, she's like the one thing people still talk about from the Last Jedi. <laughs> <laughs> True. Oh, what a helpful Raftar. Somehow Palpatine returned. He's been planning his revenge. The largest he said it. Somehow. Hiding in the unknown region. Palpatine returned. Luke's so tricked. He said to get there you need one of these. A Sith Wayfinder. I'm gonna start where his trail went cold. The Forbidden Desert of Pisana. We go together. The Forbidden Desert of Pisana. See, that would have been something that would have been useful for Luke to have brought up in The Last Jedi in order to, like, foreshadow this film. Yeah. But the director of The Last right. Jedi did not listen. Let's have it for Sonic. Yeah. To anyone's advice or instructions. Yeah. But that's not it. Yeah, here's the thing. I don't place the entire fall of Star Wars on Ryan Johnson. Like, I think Kathleen Kennedy and J.J. Abrams, you know... 
Like, I feel like, you know, just anyone whose fault it was, it was their fault, you know? Yeah. Um, so it's like, I don't place the entire blame on Ryan Johnson, but, like, Ryan, bruh. Ryan. Ryan. Logic me this. How are you going to do a redemption arc if you kill off the greater evil? Yeah. 